Well, a teen-led market on Chicago's west side that began as a pop-up now has a permanent home. WGN's Patrick Elwood shares the stories of the young entrepreneurs who attended today's grand opening celebration. One, cut the ribbon. It's a ribbon cutting like no other. Welcome to Austin Harvest. It's the dream come true for the nonprofit by the hand club for kids. Austin Harvest is entirely led by high school students from several schools in the area and who will be responsible for all the operations, including budgeting, ordering, staffing, and more. The space is 2,200 square feet with an open air patio that serves as a gathering space for local residents. It is average serving 100 customers a week with 15% of customer SNAP benefits recipients and senior service farmer market coupon recipients. Students will get an educational stipend, class credit, and real world, real life experience in customer relations. What began in 2020 amid the pandemic, originally conceived as a one season temporary thing, but it took root and has only gotten bigger and better since. Rodney Williams is the Director of Entrepreneurship and Economic Development. And we started with a pop-up tent. Um, the original program was only scheduled for 12 weeks, uh, but the community would not let us close up shop. 17-year-old Quentin Wooten is a senior at Carl Schurz High School and a student ambassador with The Harvest. Every aspect of Austin Harvest I get to lead and I get to be a part of. Next year will come college, and this experience, he believes, will plant the seeds of tomorrow while helping his neighbors of today. It enhances my knowledge in entrepreneurship, which is a field that I would like to study and a career that I like to go to, and it helps my community. I've been in Austin my entire life, so to see something like this or see a change as big as this and to be a part of it is powerful for me. The mission is to provide year-round access to produce and flowers now doing business in the very spot that used to be a liquor store, which is an all too familiar occurrence in that part of town and a shortage of grocery stores to boot. Alana Choice is also 17 and a senior at Holy Trinity Catholic High. She's also on her way to college in 2025 and says, see you later liquor store and hello, fresh food. I really like it. I thought it was a great idea and it's helping the community really, really uh, big and just making sure that uh, they stay healthy. Hand Club for Kids has partnered with Jewel Osco and Flowers for Dreams to make this possible. The hope is to be here for generations to come and perhaps maybe even replicate this business model in other neighborhoods across the city. Patrick Elwood. WGN News.